Hello everybody, it's Kimmy and welcome back to the channel and we are going to actually do a Minecraft adventure map for a while. Um, it seems that uh, I have lost some gameplay when it comes to the um, Song of the Deep series. So we're just going to do some Minecraft until I can get things taken care of. Um, it's got a, The map today is called Journey for the Golden Crest. I haven't been into it. I don't know anything. Um, I just know that. Uh, let's see. Loading. All right. So here we are. Let's see. What do we have? This block should say test on it. Yes, it does. Okay, so nope, the texture pack did load correctly. Alright, so we have that. And let's see, over here, um, allow cheats on, then click start, or oh, land world. Okay, on your keyboard, then press, oh, okay, so we just go back down here. This goes from the beginning. This head should look like a sandwich. This head should look like a sandwich. I think so. Uh, if it doesn't, yeah. Alright. Um, what is this? To enjoy this map properly, have your internet on, or the nobs won't have different heads. Oh, the mobs will. Uh, yes. Read the rule book in the chest. Rules, custom music, and glitches. Okay. Rules don't break painting, stay in adventure mode, open to land and enable cheats. If you have a problem with the commands not working, always read the books and chat for clues. Throughout your adventure, don't change the time or from night to day. Okay, have your graphics on fast. Alright. Have particles on minimum. This will prevent lag and important Particles will still show anyway. Have music off, have notebooks and jukebox settings up so you can hear them. Also, have the render disk around 11 or more if possible. Have clouds on. If you experience lag, turn clouds off. Okay, so, alright, let's. I'm gonna go ahead and do that really quick and I shall be back. Okay, so we're back. That was those. Let's see what this is. <coughs> this map has custom music, so I'll have the music set to off and have notebooks. Yes, I have all that. We are to go down here. Alright, so let's see. Let's see what we got. Uh, the map creators. Take a moment, read. Right click here to set spawn point. Did it? I'm going to assume it did. What's this? Uh, my maps, credits, and credit cards. <coughs> Click here to check out my other maps. Oh. Okay. So I think. Is this a bathroom? Very nice. Oh, I like that. Looks like toilet paper. Alright. Are we done? Are we done looking around? And here's your quest. Potion save lives. Alright, so let's start. Here we go. We're going to start the King's Quest. So your journey begins. You have lived here as long as you remember. Your father was a great knight, but now he is gone. You are about to embark on your quest to become a true knight. 
But first, look for a sword before you leave. You will need some type of weapon for your tri trials ahead. Good luck, you may. Good luck, and may the Knights of Valor give you strength, the King's Advisor. Well, I didn't see any place here that had a sword. Can we not get out? Did I miss something? Hello? Maybe I was supposed to read this one too. The best way to play this map is on normal difficulty, but you can switch. Gotcha on that one. You will find many potions on your journey. You should always have some equipped in your hot bar, especially when entering a boss room. They will save your life on many occasions. Oh. Yay. Alright, so I need a sword. As opposed to, it's an inner chest. I'm supposed to find a sword. Oh, we got some pork chops. Quest diary. And my sword. Sweet. Go back down here. Quest guide. This is a quick guide. You will need to know what quest is next, but you can also give your spoilers on some of the locations which can take away the mystery. Okay. Find your father's old sword in your house. All right. My son, I have hidden my sword behind the bookshelves downstairs. Find it before you leave. I want you to have it. Even though it is old and rusty, it will protect you. I did like really find you just told us where it was. In the book shelves downstairs. Okay. Do we just like How are we supposed to get to the bookshelves downstairs? Um. Hit it in the bookshelves downstairs. There's a button. I found it. If you are playing solo, you only need one sword. Beginner sword. So say, hmm, now I have a sword. I should place this key on the top of the log to exit. Oh, yes. I'm free! <gasps> Whoa, hello, dude. So you are to begin your trials to become a knight. I have a book for you from the kitchen. Well, good luck. I am sure you will make a fine knight any way. Here's the book I just gave you to teleport around by clicking around. Okay. The journey for the ascension. Well, that was fancy. I want to look outside. It's very nice. Alright, so let's go. What do we have? Get my sword out. What is up here? Hi guys! Hello! I wish you well today on your trials. I heard that your first task is to retrieve the red orb from the Temple of Fire. Well, you should be careful- What?
But you should be careful. The temple is supposedly full of traps and puzzles, but I have no doubt you will be a great knight like your father was. Your father left me some books to give to you on the morning of your trials, in case he didn't return from his mission. Now, climb the ladder that just appeared, young master, and read the books in the chest, of course, and remember to open... Oh, the land to teleport. Okay. Thank you. The ladder that just appeared. And I saw that on the corner of my eye. I saw that. Okay. Uh, yellow. What's that? Wood currency? I'm taking this. Because, uh... Yeah. Because I think, I think I need it. I like the crafting table. Look. I check them all. You never know when something's going to be in them. Alright, so, let's see, you took your bread too, man, thank you, alright, so let's go up here, and let's check, okay, so, the Knight's Trials book, see, your trials are about to begin, your first test will be to retrieve the red orb from the temple. On the second page, you can left click to teleport to 10 Mile Island South, the Temple of Fire, or back here. Talk to the villagers here first before you leave. Okay, so this is our teleporting book. Gotcha. And this is our quest diary. So we want that. Alright, so let's see. Uh, family vault. Gives you a teleporting book. And your family vault. Alright, so. Hmm. My son, if you are reading this, then I am gone and I have left you our, our family vault and some treasures as well to help you through your life. One day you will be a great knight and will understand that. Being a knight has its rewards, so you will definitely need to use the vault room to store all your items you find throughout your adventures. If you use the other book I left in the chest, you can teleport to your vault. Okay, so we don't need this one no more. Uh, we don't need that no more. And, uh... This is the Knight's Trials, the Knight's... I don't think we need the quest thing. Yeah, no. So we don't need that one either. And let's check, I don't want all these books. Okay, so this is our teleporting book. And this is our quest diary. Yes, this is the one that tells us what we're gonna do. Okay, so this one here is our family vault. Teleport to your vault. Click here. <gasps> Ooh. Store all your treasures in these chests. This vault was built and test. Oh. Trade with villagers in the lands of Tallowood. Oh, that's pretty cool. Do they have it in all of them? Take the books in the chest and leave. Uh, one in your chest at home and one in your inner chest just in case you lose the original. Uh, Knight's Trial, your family vault, family vault, and the Knight's Trial. Okay. And, and, and more. Okay, so let's see. So, oh, whoops. We're supposed to take the books. Okay, so one there and one for us. Um, family vault and one for us. Cool. I'm gonna put our under stuff. Right click here to teleport just outside your house. Okay, that was cool. Awesome! 
and see if we up what's this regeneration oh so there's our stuff right there cool very cool so let's go look at look at the doors look at the doors they got the little skull face that's awesome are you gonna talk to me I was out watering the red flowers the other day and I lost them. I lost my family treasure, my white. Two white jewels, if you find them near. What? They always go so quick. And lost them. I lost my family treasures, my two white jewels. If you find them near all the tall red flowers, you know, near the path past your house, I will trade you for them, these boots. Well, Becky. I will go look for your two white jewels, but I'm taking these because I want to. Alright. That's an oven. Alright. Two white jewels that was just out there and by in the red flowers past the house. talking about red flowers this isn't even the quest that we needed carrots carrots uh -uh. She, I don't know what she's talking about these are pretty though Nope, I did not find him. We will come back to that later. Let's keep on going. Oh wait, these are red flowers. Look at the little birds up there. Okay, so white jewels past the red flowers. That would. <gasps> What's this? Can I get to this? I cannot. How do I open that? I cannot open that. This one. Whoa! Family jewel. That was cool. Wait, what's 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 in there? I wonder. Come on. All right, so we found them. Yay! And I think we're going to go ahead and end it here. Let's go turn in our family tools. And collect our reward. And then we will say bye in this episode. You found my family. Oh, thank you. Fine, sir. Now let's make a frame swap. The jewels for the boots. Mm. Do I do, do I just give them to you? Oh. There you go. Awesome. Oh, you don't want those? Hold on. Ooh, speed boots. Thank you. Thank you very much.
Alright guys, so thank you for watching this episode. Uh, go ahead and leave me a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And please check out the other videos. And uh, so check out the map down below in the description. And bye! Oh, quick sin, quick sin, no, 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 no. Dig down, Lock, dig down. Jump. Dig down. I'm trying. Oh. I have nothing to dig with. <laughs> I'm oh, coming. No.